How did that feel? Ooh, that was actually kind of fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I still hold it. Okay, wait. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm really happy that you guys are enjoying this series. It really means a lot to me. And if you haven't seen my previous videos, I have a playlist of all the days before this where I learned how to ride a motorcycle. Today is day four and I'm gonna be taking your advice going to a better location to practice. I'll be practicing starting and stopping again, turning, abruptly stopping, and counter steering. So let's get right into the video. Now we have a big open parking lot, empty. As a little warm up to get me back into it because it's been a minute. I'm gonna just do a little slow circle, not go over the speed bump all the way around, and then just see, see how I'm comfortable with that. And then we'll do some other exercises after. Oh, oh. okay. I couldn't feel the speed bump. There we go, okay. Now we're Okay, stop, stop. <laughs> A little rusty at first. Um, now I, I want you to do four of those loops the other way. All right, how did that feel? Um, yeah, where the heck? Out of sight. <laughs> I, I, it's harder to do the right turn. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's always a preference I feel like people have with yeah. one or the other. Um, that was really good. So what are we doing now? Practicing, oh wait, practicing starting and stopping using the lines um, as a guide. So I'm going to go from one line to the third line, at the third line. I'm stopping hard, practicing like a emergency break or like a quick stop what is it feeling what it feels like to abruptly stop yes it was good <laughs> that's okay <laughs> That's why we're doing it. It's great. It's okay. <laughs> but yeah, back up your tire so you're on the line so you have equal space. Perfect. That looked really good, especially okay. the last few. The last few, yeah. Did they better. feel better? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. How's the starting going? The starting feels a little wobbly, but I'm not stalling it, so that's good. I mean, it looked good. It felt strong. You could feel it like pitching forward there, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Was that weird? Um, Feeling at least? Yeah, but not scary. Cool. Now you're going to try it with just the back brake. So you just kind of understand what that pedal, how it feels. 
Okay, so what was it, what was the first thing you noticed with the back brake? It's like not that much power at all. It's on an incline, ish. Like yeah. Kinda, like on a hill. The more I pressed on it, I just kept rolling. When I wanted to put my feet down, mm -hmm. they kept moving forward. So I should have, you know. Okay, so only do it just to the end here. So I mean, you'll get a really good idea of. And then when you get to the bottom, you're gonna do both at the same time. Okay. Ooh. Look at all the chickens running. What happened? I stalled it because it wasn't holding in the clutch. Ah. Yeah. Because using both does take more like it does, coordination and thought. On my mental and I just mm -hmm. forgot about the last one. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, how did that feel? Better. Okay, sorry. Where were we? Um, <laughs> just kidding. Starting and stopping. Starting and stopping. Oh, wait, it's kicking. So this is just like if I came across something and I was going really fast and I had to hit it. Yes. Like an example of when you would really need to do that. Let's say there's, I think they use this as an example always, is like a two by four in the middle of the road, which does happen, construction oh. stuff. Some people try to swerve, do whatever they can to not hit it, much more dangerous. Yeah. You can easily hit it head on and just, just ride over it. In fact, that should be on your test. Yeah, I think it I is. think it will be, yeah. yeah. Oh my God. How did that feel? Ooh, that was actually kind of fun. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm going to be do doing just tight circles mm -hmm. and counter steering. Ooh. Um, <laughs> <I'm gonna> <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I don't know. It's like a big thing. I don't know. It is a big thing. It's <laughs> going to be a game changer. I'm nervous, but I'm going to try to stay within this outside line. What do you think is happening? It's so much harder at the end time. I feel like I don't have enough momentum and the bike is definitely like pulling over. Exactly. Remember I was saying going uphill, yeah. starting on an incline is really hard. Pretty hard. Yeah. Was really good. It's hard it is. Hill. It really is. And we are going to do loads of practice of going on an incline later. Okay. So now go the opposite way. No. Gotta get used to that other turn. <laughs> You're not, what is it, the UPS? You know, they only make right turns or something. <laughs>
It's okay, you got it. How did that feel to you? For some reason it felt better <laughs> than the other way. Yeah, I think you could do more. I know. But definitely take it easy, you know, you're just getting used to it. Okay, so what are you doing now? Now it's playtime. <laughs> and what is that? It means like I'll just have free time to kind of practice everything. Maybe take some turns, hit the speed bump. Right, incorporate. Use the brakes. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Hi. Okay. It got cut short because security came and basically kicked us off of the property. But I'm glad I was able to practice quite a bit before that happened. I definitely want to work on counter steering more. I don't think I was doing it correctly or enough. But for my first time, I was really impressed with myself. If you're interested in this series and you want to see more, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'll be posting more motorcycle content and vlogs. My MSF course is soon, very, very soon. So I will let you guys know how that goes. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Thank you.